was David Gilbert right on top of Braxton Miller. Numbers on the inside, Tess. They gave him numbers on the inside, and Braxton Miller, he's going to try to just, this is going to be a planned run. It's going to be a, kind of a, the old counter OT, but they hold the edge, and then Gilbert's able to finish it off, sets up a fourth down. Buckeye strike first. down at the 15-yard line. High snap, and here's Hyde straight up the middle and into the end zone for a touchdown. 15-yard touchdown run by Carlos Hyde, his 14th of the year. Here's Ball again, and look at him go past midfield. And he's carrying this Badgers offense now. Another first down for Wisconsin. Yeah, just nice vision. And do you see the patience just that little bit? He just lets the block occur, and then, boom, he bursts right through it. Gets stronger. Phillips to pass now on second and six. Downfield, wide open, and gets it complete. And that is his tight end, Jacob Pedersen. Pedersen, that's right there, number 48. They just do a good job. Now, he's clearing. That takes a long time to get there, so that tells you that there's good pass protection. And because Phillips has that time... Touchdowns in college football history. Here's second and six. And here is Monte Ball. Can he get there? Yes! more impressive Ohio State knows they're running the ball here Tess they commit eight to that front and ball there's no way he was staying out of the end zone fourth and four Phillips with time throws it to the near side and complete for a first down to Kenzel Doe Ohio State sits in the zone that time they sit in the zone, and no pressure. Nice job by this offensive line of giving Phillips time to be able to throw. And watch, watch Doe on the outside. Just, they run it off, and he dumps underneath. It's great awareness of where the first down is and gets it. Monte Ball. Could he? As he is forced out, a big gainer down to the 21 and a block ahead from Jacob Pedersen led the way. Monte Ball had Pedersen in front of him, didn't quite know what to do with him. That's actually a very good job defensively. It's a fumble, and it is recovered by Ohio State. Christian Bryant was in the right spot at the right time. The ball went right to him. Ryan Shazer forced the fumble, and the ball family can't believe it. And neither can their son, but a great job of Ohio State at the point. And that's Shazer. What? A phenomenal play, great read, throws himself in recklessly like he has been all night long, hits the ball and the man, and it goes the other way. He was trying to reach out and break that plane and tie this game and set the record. Instead, Shazier, who was knocked out of the game for a moment, comes in, and remains second and goal. Phillips looking, looking, looking to the end zone. How about that? Jacob Pedersen. First and goal. Just like that, Ohio State moving with ease. And High just steps over the defender into the end zone. And Ohio State puts a touchdown on the board. Heck, they just 
They just played power football. Did a nice job. Carlos Hyde wasn't even challenged. 